Before you create a pivot table, you need to organize your source data. First, make sure there are no empty columns or empty rows in the data. To remove an empty column or row, hold down Control and then click or right click on the column or row and then click Delete. Also, make sure that each column heading has a descriptive label. For example, let's change this label to Total Sales. Now, to create your pivot table, click anywhere in the data. Then, on the Data tab, click the arrow next to the Pivot Table button. Here, you have the option to let Excel create the pivot table automatically, or to create one manually. In this video, we'll use the automatic option. This option is quicker, and once the pivot table is created, you can easily customize it to show exactly what you want. Now, click Create Automatic Pivot Table, and Excel creates the pivot table on a new worksheet for you. Keep in mind that you can create multiple pivot tables in a single workbook. Each one that you create will appear in its own worksheet. In the next lesson, we'll look at the pivot table and some of the pivot table tools.